once was a town that was home to many villagers. The villagers were constantly being terrorized by a vile monster, the Metacrine. Each night, the Metacrine would stalk down from the hills and devour one of the villagers. The terrified villagers, the terrified villagers called a meeting and decided to pool their money together to hire the great hero, Eric. The great hero, Eric, came and listened to the complaints of the villagers. He consulted his book of vile monsters and learned that Metacrins love to eat loons. So then, the great hero, Eric, hunted high and low to find a loon. He found one, and he captured it, and he brought it back to the villagers, who threw the loon into a deep pit, hoping to capture the Metacrin. That night, the Metacrin came. It smelled the loon. But it also smelled danger. And it ran off for the evening. After calming the villagers, the great hero, Eric, again consulted his book of vile monsters and learned that Metacrins also love sugar. So the great hero, Eric, gathered up all of the sugar he could find and threw it into the pit. <laughs> the loon, who by this point had not eaten for days, devoured all of the sugar in a single gulp. The great hero, Eric, was struck with panic thinking that his plan would no longer work. That night, the Metacrin returned. It smelled the loon. It smelled danger. But it also smelled the sugar. And the Metacrin dived into the pit, devouring the loon. The Metacrin was finally captured, trapped in the pit forever. The plan had worked, and the villagers rejoiced. The villagers rejoiced! And the moral of tonight's story is, a loon full of sugar helps the Metacrin go down.